Hello, my name is Johnny. Welcome to another look back on the Hot 100 60 years ago, week ending March 28th, 1964. Now, let's see how many Beatles songs on here this week and where they are. First, we're going to start over here and take a quick look at the bubbling under chart. I'll let you look at that. The one that stands out to me is number 103 there. Towards the top, Bits and Pieces by Dave Clark 5 by Epic. So another uh, British Invasion group. Getting another song on here. Let's take a look here. What we've got shows the position, the positions in the former weeks and number of weeks on the chart. There's B.B. King with a song there at 97. Otis Redding at 93. Herb Albert at 92. There's that letter to the Beatles. Only moved up one by the four preps. There's Do You Want to Know a Secret on VJ by the Beatles, number 78. So that's another new one on the charts for them. There's Roll Over Beethoven, second week on the chart. That's the capital of Canada. So these are getting... Releases all over the place here, not just their basic American uh, capital. Here's All My Loving, <laughs> Beatles Capital of Canada. That might be the A or B side or flip side, however you want to say it, of the, the other one down there. So 71, so we got another Beatles song on there. Let's move over to the middle column. There's Nat King Cole at number 66. Rick Nelson at 64. There's that We Love the Beatles by the Carefree. It was 73 and 57, so we got songs about the Beatles along with the Beatles on here. It's Jan and Dean. Number 52, two weeks on the charts, News Girl in School. It's Chubby Chapter. There's the Beatles on VJ, four weeks. It's gone from 86 to 73 to 58 to 50, from me to you. Beatles, Beatles, Beatles. There's Johnny Cash at number 39. Sammy Davis at 38. Dead Man's Curve by Jan and Dean, number 34. Okay, let's flip this over this way and start to look at the first column. There's the Swingin' Blue Jeans with the Hippie Hippie Shake at number 31, and that British Invasion group. That's on Imperial Records. There's Elvis there at 29. There's the Beatles, uh, another new one. Can't Buy Me Love, first week on the charts. Capital, number 27, starting off right there. Right next to uh, Capital, I saw her standing there. Eight weeks on the charts, so that's starting to come down now at number 26. There's the Searchers with Needles and Pins, uh, number 20. Cap Records, Four Seasons, and number 18. Temptations, Kissing Cousins, number 12. Was number 12 last week, six weeks on the charts. So we're going to get right into the top 10 here. Glad All Over by Dave Clark 5. So they're releasing, they got the one in the bubbling. Under to come on because there have been seven weeks on this. See if this gets much higher here. There's Bobby Vinton. Hello, Dolly. Louis Armstrong. Where are the Beatles songs? They're coming up. There's the Beach Boys with Fun, Fun, Fun. 
Four Seasons, Dawn Go Away. And now we got the Beatles at number four with Please Please Me on VJ. Was number three, now it's down to four. What's number three this week? Twist and Shout on the Tolly Tolly label. Was number seven, three weeks on the charts, and it's up number three. Ah, we got I Want to Hold Your Hand. Was number one a couple weeks ago, now it's number two. 11 weeks on the chart, and that's on Capitol. And on Swan Records, they got She Loves You. Move, it's at number one for the second week, was number two, so those two songs slipped. So right now, the Beatles have one, two, three, four in a row in the top 100, plus all those other songs we saw, plus songs about the Beatles. Never to be repeated again, folks, what's going on in these charts. And this is March 28th, 1964. Will it even get more crowded at the top of the charts? We will see coming up. More to come next week. Thanks for watching, everyone.